Hi, this is Blaine Cluton for Cluton Law. The question today is, do lawyers get paid if they lose? The answer to this is going to depend on the type of fee agreement. In a traditional fee agreement, such as for family law, or even if a lawyer is defending you on a case where uh, somebody's brought an action against you for something that you did that was negligent or wrongful, such as a wrongful termination, most likely, even if you lose that case, the fee agreement calls for you to pay your attorney no matter what, and it's not outcome determinative. There are also contingent fee agreements, and those are more traditionally done in personal injury type cases. And those are the ones that you hear on TV commercials where the lawyer says, I don't get paid unless you get paid. And those ones truly are contingent. They're contingent on recovery. And if you do end up recovering under a personal injury lawsuit or a personal injury claim, then the fee agreement is going to determine what the recovery for the attorney is gonna be as well. And it depends state by state about whether the attorney is gonna be obligated to go after, after the, um, the client for fees if you're not successful in the action, such as for um, if you had doctor's fees or expert fees um, or other related filing fees or costs. But generally speaking, attorneys uh, do not go after clients if they're not successful in their action for those types of costs and fees that were incurred. Um, they usually only recover those fees if it's part of a, a global resolution, global settlement, or at the end of trial if you uh, were successful in the action and the juries made you an award, then they're taking those fees out of that award. Um, so it, it kind of it's going to depend on the the fee structure that you have and that you've negotiated for on the front end uh, as an answer to this question. This is Blaine Cluton for Cluton Law. If you have further questions about whether you're going to owe attorney fees at the end of the year case, it's best to ask those questions to the attorney during that consultation or as you're signing that retainer agreement. Thank you.